Hi Moby family, Claude here and today we are here in the wonderful Avon Valley and we are going to show you how to set up our privacy room. This Fiamo privacy room is probably one of our most popular ones uh, purely because it's easy to set up and it will keep out flies. But we'll show you that now. So as you can see we've got our crank awning out. Now just important to note that when you bring your crank awning out uh, you've got to strap it down. So best to have your um, uh, Fiamo strap down kit and also strap that down and then what we then do is we take the anti-flap kit and as you can see it consists of two parts that slides into each other they are nicely marked and they will say right on this side and they will say right on that side as well so the first thing that we do is we put it into that receiver what you then make sure is that that uh, it will go in the canvas or the vinyl and then on this side you make sure that it goes into this particular it's got to go into that particular slot then you make sure that your your vinyl is in between the clamp and then we start and we just clamp it now just a little bit of pressure if it's not enough pressure you just tighten it or loosen it and then we just do the whole one once we're done with this uh, we will do the, the right hand side one as well so what we'll do next is we're going to put the draft skirt up now important to note that the draft skirt has got one one piece that is at an angle that's a piece that goes to the back and when you feed the draft skirt you start feeding it from the center so you put the first the center part in then we feed it to the back make sure that our valve goes sits there and we feed it to the front so next we're going to put the two side walls up now just important you can see that the side walls is marked right and left the part that goes against the moby has got these foam socks in and they go into this sock so first we will put both of them in and once you've put them in you will just close it with the velcro and then we're going to put it up Alright, so the right is on the inside and then just make sure when you feed it into the gutter that the rope slide that you keep it straight otherwise it can be a little bit frustrating <laughs> and then we just feed it bit by bit make sure that we stay straight so as you can see we've got the side panel on now what we did do is we rolled up the plastic so that we can get a little bit of wind through because there is a little bit of wind that's irritating the next thing that we want to do is we want to seal this against the Moby and for that we've got this pole now what's nice about this is that the top part as it pushes in it's got a spring it's spring loaded and the bottom part is how you lock it in so what we do is we've got the hole at the top there and we will push that pin in there now you can see that it's spring loaded so at the bottom we'll just make it long enough so that there is a little bit of spring on it and then we will take and we will push it until we can see that it's actually sealing against the motor and then we just take the velcro we just attach the pole now you can see we've got a nice seal here and then we're going to do exactly the same on the left hand side so now that we've put the sides up and we velcro uh, it against the, the legs now we're going to put the front part on now the front part consists of three pieces which you can interchange so depending on where you want your door you have a window that's got no mesh and then you've got a door and then you've got a big window that's got mesh and all of them has got curtains as well for this setup we have chosen to have the door in line with your Moby door so you can just walk straight through but you can do that as you wish 
So what we do is we feed it in the bottom sl uh, slide because the top slide we will use for the uh, strap down kits from Fiama and it's just a question of feeding it in like that and obviously because it's big we've taken all three of them simultaneously um, it's better if you do it with a friend right now that we feed it in through the rope slide uh, we're gonna now just close it down with these zips so it's just a question of putting it together closing it up now like I said you've got your window here this is your door which is not the same uh, it's not the same zip than what you were doing for the to put it together um, if you notice here you can see that you've got a big zip and then you've got a very fine one so the fine one is the door the big one is putting the panels together So after attaching the front wall, we can now roll up the door because we're open for business. All right, now we start tidying up the walls. One of the things that you want to do is you want to keep this wall straight. For that, you've got these four pieces. Now when this little hook of yours or hole of yours is fairly close to your peg, all you will do is you will hook this onto there, you will hook it through that and then you will attach it to your peg. Now what happens is when the wind blows you can see how that stretches. Now if that distance is too far all you will do is you will use this extension piece and all you do is you make it like that and now you use it for the same purpose you hook it on there that's your elastic and then this side you just attach it to the same hook all right Moby family we took a couple of minutes to just straighten everything out uh, obviously if you're gonna stay long you will pick it down maybe put a ground sheet down uh, and if you have a cold beer it's now the time to drink it